Welcome back to Love and Junk. I'm Laura. I'm John. And today we have the second half of a Canadian viewer box, the sweeter half of the box that we're going to be trying for you today. This comes from our friend Terry, who lives in Logan Lake. Yep. And uh, she sent, where is that? What? She sent a sweet little letter and then a pin to the letter. We've got this little pin uh, from but Logan where Lake. Was, where was Logan Lake, Ontario? Uh, I think so. No, uh, British Columbia. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So if you're interested, uh, which I am always interested, I love quaint little teensy towns. Yeah. Um, she said there's no stoplights and... twenty five Less than 2,500 people live in the town. Um, it's a big mining community. Yeah, copper mine there. So we're going to go on YouTube and look it up when we're done. But uh, we have been to Canada on vacation together one time. It was very short. We've talked about it. It's one of our favorite vacations ever, actually. I just wanted to ball my head off and stay much longer because it was so short. Yeah, um, unfortunately, it wasn't long enough to be considered a vacation. <laughs> yeah. A, a trip to go see a concert. But. Right. We went to see Elton John, uh, which was amazing. And we should just sit and do a story time sometime about that vacation. Yeah, put up some pictures and stuff like that. Yeah. And obviously, yeah. we can't play the audio because of copyright. Yeah, but we had an amazing time, and it was just cut short. We had poutine there, we did some thrifting, and, you know, we mm -hmm. had a really good time. So, the first half of this video was a box of some, uh, I mean, we are crisp chip people. We love that always, and whenever we get set boxes. were amazing. They were amazing, amazing, amazing. Which yes. I was not surprised because when we went to Canada, we had some amazing chips while we were there. Or we yeah. brought them back with us, actually. Yeah, well, we did a video on that, so we'll link that playlist uh, at the end. But we tried uh, old, old, old Dutch um, All Dressed. I love all dressed and chips. That was really good. Um, what else did we try? Well, did we try? Oh, I wait. made John. I didn't care. He was bucking me out of the way, and I was like, "We are going to try ketchup chips while we were here." Oh, and he was yeah. like, "No, we don't. Let's try this." He was trying to get out of it because he doesn't like ketchup. Um, I loved ketchup chips, and they were okay. <laughs> um, but the things that were amazing that we got was um, great value from Walmart in Winnipeg. We got those char-grilled chicken chips. You could taste the... They weren't kidding when they said char-grilled. You could taste the char in the chips. They were amazing. They were really good. But from the box that Terry sent us, mm -hmm. never had we ever had cheese puffs that were flavored. We had deep dish pizza cheese puffs. Mm -hmm. We had Old Dutch everything and including my new like i'm gonna have to go online and see if we can get them i can never go back to fritos she, <laughs> she completely ruined me for fritos um yeah. old dutch corn chips john doesn't even like corn chips and and they were really good we're both gonna That's be hearing the about thing. this fritos are so like grainy and and i love them and you know they're fine but they i hadn't i didn't know better you know mm, what i mean i can't I can't eat them. It tastes like ashtray, ashes for like an ashtray or something. <laughs> but those old Dutch, wow, they were good. I love the texture of them. But yeah. Anyway. So today we have some sweets. Oh, we should also say let's let's show um, my favorite. Well, I don't know if it's my favorite thing, <laughs> but I'm sure it will be. Was I it, have is never it the maple seen. Syrup? Yes, <laughs> I have never seen maple syrup in a can like this before and yeah. if you don't know me um maple syrup is something that i, I mean i could probably just put this on ice <laughs> <laughs> i love maple syrup i love maple everything yeah. and i was super excited so we'll be trying that in an upcoming video she also sent us a package of dipping sauce some yeah. canada dry ginger ale um maxwell house a cappuccino orange yeah. cappuccino we're gonna be uh trying their kd versus our craft mac and cheese and see if they're the same or different and look at this finally 
we were going to go online and order some. So be looking for those videos coming soon. We're going to try all of that stuff. Um, also, we're not going to try it in this. Well, yeah, we probably will try in this video. Flake? Maybe. I mean, we've tried it before, and there's 24 of them. How many months are there in a year? And there's two of us, so we can each have... There's 24, so you can each so have... So there's at least two weeks' worth in there. <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> I was going to say, we could eat, we could divvy them out and each have one a month. But we are definitely going to try flakes on ice cream. You guys keep telling us that. We're going to do that. Maybe Yeah, we'll have to try those. What am I, what am I saying? We'll have to do it in this video. All of the rest of this candy is new. Yeah. We think... Uh, I said in the previous video, and I meant it, we had arrow bars while we were there. And I came back, and in that video, I said, what other flavors does this come in? Because mm -hmm. I wasn't sure. And somebody said mint, which was one of, you know, maple syrup. That's another is, favorite flavor. Maple, yeah, syrup is my one true love. But I was going to say, that's another favorite <laughs> color, but no. But, <laughs> but followed closely by mint. And when I found out there was a mint arrow bar, I knew I wanted yeah. to try it. So I'm excited for that. And we can get some arrow bars here in the States, but never these flavors like that. It, we only see the original ever. I mean, yeah. and I, I don't know about the States, but where we live in the Midwest, you know, we don't, maybe in New York City or something where it's bigger. But right here, we only see the regular, I think. Regular. So I'm excited to try all and of this. And hippo. I saw Hippo and freaked out, <laughs> didn't I? Yeah. What brand is that? That's, that's Arrow, that's Arrow too? Yeah. Um, oh, no, it's, it's not. not. It's Kinder. Yeah. My mistake. I saw one in the store and freaked out. Anyway, we're starting to see a few things. You know, I believe... Uh, this is going to tell you a little bit about me. I believe in what you focus on expands, right? Like what you, if you focus on the positive, hopefully you have more positive. That's yeah. just how I like to roll. And that doesn't mean that I never have a bad day, but that is how I try to, you know. Live your life. Right. Yeah. Um, we are focusing on eating all these new things and international things. And so things start to like, Pop out. Hey, oh, yeah. there's this brand hey, that we were. Yeah. So when we saw the hippo, I freaked out and had to take a picture. It's on Instagram if you're not following <laughs> us on there. Anyway, um, what are you most excited to try? I don't know, but I think we should start with this rockets because we do have Smarties here. That's what we call them. And they look exactly the same. Like the packaging and stuff looks very similar to this. Tonight. No, no vetoes. What about the cookies? Yeah, we can try the cookies uh, when we get to it. All right. So I was going to say, what I want to try the most is those, see those maple cream cookies? All right. They're like saying, Psst. Let's try the cookies. Because all the rest of this is, well, not all. It's fruity and then chocolate. And this is kind of like neither. Oh, uh, they got a little beat up in That's transportation. Okay. But uh, I love the size of them. Like some of the ones we get the Dare cookies here, they're huge. Can you? I just cracked the. Uh, <laughs> what did they say about. Um, cookie? Thank you. About mermaids calling to sailors. <laughs> That's what maple cookies do to me. They call my name. Mm -hmm. I mean, these are going to be good, right? Yes, they are. They smell. Oh, that smells yeah, so good. Yeah, they smell amazing. Mmm, mmm. Drink. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, these are Oh, great. my gosh. I'm going to have to hide these. For sure. I want some milk. The cookies are just perfect. The cream is great. They're not too hard. They're perfect. And the cream on the inside is so soft. And the flavor oh, I is love great. This. I, you know, I eat Ore Oreos. You see me eat Oreos and you see me eat other stuff. But when I can pick a cookie, it is almost always maple cookies. 
sometimes a lemon, sometimes a vanilla cookie, but and we love shortbread. Oh, we yeah. both love shortbread. That's but my fave. I got John Gooden hooked on maple cookies, huh? Oh yeah. I didn't right. even know they existed. Yeah. Poor guy. All right. Do you want to continue on with this vein yet? Um, like the. I don't these think I don't think or... chocolate. I think we go fruity then chocolate. All right. Maple to fruity to chocolate. Here we go. Rockets. Uh, when I was a little girl, <laughs> I thought about telling the story, then thought I shouldn't, but I will. Maybe I shouldn't, but I already started it. Um, I had. <laughs> This is so embarrassing. <laughs> I don't I, even know what you're going to say. I know. I haven't told you this story before. Ooh. <laughs> um, I mean, it's not that racy or anything. Oh, cheers, Reaction by the Reaction video. Um, you know, little girls play dress up in house and, you know, whatever. And so, in my purse, um, I had a, <laughs> like a, an aspirin bottle or something. Like when we were kids... I don't know at what point child safety came into it, but <laughs> <laughs> they ch that changed at some point. But I had a, a bot a, a like a um, pill bottle that my mom threw away, and I got it from the trash and washed it out. And I would take Smarties and put them in the pill bottle and put them in my purse. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be like, I have a headache. <laughs> yeah. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> what do you think about the rockets? Well, I was going to say, I mean, the reason I brought that up was it, you know, like, I feel like I ate them a lot when I was a little kid. And I don't know the last time I've had one. It just reminded me immediately of being, you know, eight or whatever. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Same flavor, I think. Isn't that? Mm-hmm. Although, these seem to be... A little more sour, which I like. Um, I would only get like Smarties for usually Halloween. Get them all those. through the Halloween bucket. That's that thing that I like. <laughs> that compressed powder kind of sherbet thing that I like. Yeah, except for sometimes it's fizzy, tangy, and sometimes it's not. Mm -hmm. I love that kind of thing. I don't know why. I always have like sweet tarts and all that kind of stuff. I've always loved it. Those are good. Very nice. Very nice. All right. Now you get to pick one. Mm -hmm. Little popping candies. Yeah. You want to open the other one? Uh, sure. How do you? Well, there's a tear thing on the side way down here. Oh. Let's see. Speaking of this. I gotta ask them a question. I mean, I just recently learned this. I mean, I think I knew about it before, but I didn't think about it for a really long time. I wanna know if other people in the world do this. We don't, but I think it's a good idea. My mom used to do it and I forgot about it. Do you, when you have a bag of, let's say these are crisps or, Chips. yeah. <laughs> do you cut the bag when they're halfway down? Do you cut the bag and that, so it's not, Rolling a whole bunch of stuff and over. And your hand doesn't... Yeah, roll. like it's barbecue chips and your hand's touching all of it on the way. I'm just curious. Um, that was interesting that it was all the way down because I expected it was going to be at the top. That's what made me think of it. You learned so right. much. <laughs> Laura was a pill popper <laughs> as a kid. <laughs> this is like jumping around in my hand. Ready? Oh, you're going to love these. What kind do you have? Apple? Apple. Which I've never had apple flavor in, like, Pop Rocks or... Is wow. It? These are really poppy. Are yours, um... It doesn't say it. I'm just curious when I see that color. <laughs> I feel like I'm shooting at you <laughs> by talking. Is it sour apple? When I see that color green, I think sour mm -hmm. apple, but it just says apple, huh? Mm -hmm. Um, a Pop Rock landed on my cheek. Um, you're going <laughs> to like the grape. Grape. I love popping candy. Um, a friend of ours, a viewer, for, you know, viewer friend sent us 
a big bar of the um, chocolate with popping candy in it. Yeah, I loved Cadbury. it. Yeah, loved it. Ready? Oh, that is just apple. I always think sour apple. We don't have anything in the States that I know of that I can think of that is just apple. That's not sour apple. That's a candy. Can you? No. Even apples are just sour apples. That's nice. That's nice. Good pop. Mm-hmm. Very cool. poppy. And I don't feel like... Correct me if I'm wrong. Anybody or you. I feel like in the States, Pop Rocks are nostalgic candy. Yeah. Where we get sent popping candy in the UK boxes. So it must be more popular there. And it's not nostalgic. It's just popular. And so I wonder, yeah. are these... I think they made a comeback. Yeah, but I don't think most kids like choose pop rocks i always did yeah i loved pop rocks i still do well you know they had to take them off the market a long time ago because of that death you can't eat pop rocks and drink pepsi you stop that no? all right urban legend all right <laughs> now let's do these all right which one do you want to try uh, are we just going to try one? Red or blue? I don't know. Which one do you want? Yeah, we can probably just try one. Or do you want to try them both? We can try them both. Okay. I don't care. All right. How, what are the now, flavors? first question, how do we open it? <laughs> uh, let's see. Flavors. I see something. Here's oh, a, this is Wild Cherry Berry. Here's an arrow pointing right here. Oh, thanks. I can even see that in mine. All right. So the one side of these... You get these little gummy candies, and... Isn't there, like, directions on the front that says do this, then do that? Uh, oh, yeah, it has, yeah. like, a... What's mine? I the hiccups. Oh, great. Gummy candies and sour gel. Yep. All right, I'm getting my sour gel out. Uh, yeah. Ooh, there it is. Look at this. Isn't that cool? It's like, uh, yeah. It's when like I was a kid, I would have loved this. And your mom probably would have hated it, right? Yeah. All <laughs> it's right. the kind of thing that kids love and moms are like, you're going to make a dang mess. So there's a little, like, hole or fill spot I'll put in the mine. candy. Here you go. I'll pass you this. And oh, okay. You pass me that. Well, I got that. Hold on. We'll try these first. And then we'll try the other ones. So yeah, a little hollowed out section. And this then, is like a treat and an activity. Yeah, and a mess, I'm sure. You know, kids probably leave it on the, throw it on the floor, shove it on the couch. Cheers. Cheers. Wow. Woo! Mmm. Those are good. Mm -hmm. I mean, just like, wow, that gel has got a lot of sour flavor. I'm going to try it by itself. <laughs> that was a mistake. <laughs> mm, I don't Woo! think it was. I think it was excellent. I wanted to find out if the sour was just in here. Mm-hmm. All right, let's try blue. Ooh, that flavor is Rebel. nice, though. Okay, Whatever you said that was, that was. Someone's gonna get hurt here. Yeah, the flavor's not. All right, oh, and now the flying. candies are everywhere. Gummies flying everywhere. I've went out for me. Yeah. What's this flavor? Oh, this one's got. Oh, the cat must still be in the inside there. Look, it's like a pen. A pen cap. Oh yeah, here's this. That's. That's good. Good, good thinking, good, good. juicy whoever you are, juicy drops. Just, yeah. Good thinking. All right, here's your juicy drop. Plenty Thanks. of squishy stuff. I'll take that one from you. Dun, dun, dun. What flavor is this? Blue Rebel. Mm. Woo. 
Mm-hmm. That, that one's more sour than the first one for me. The first one I didn't think was sour. I like that mm -hmm. flavor though. The blue. It's like a blue raspberry kind of. Mm. And here's the thing you could eat it without the sour if you thought it was too sour. Mm -hmm. Or if you're like feeling tired or anything, you can just mainline that and mm -hmm. <laughs> wake right up. Yes. Yum. Yeah. All right, we got one more thing to try over here for, like, the candy. Cake. I think we can end on that, don't you? Or not? Because it's gum. Oh, yeah. Let's end on the gum. Okay. Next. Let's... What am I kidding? Is there a peel thing on this one? I don't know. Does it say peel? I don't know. <laughs> Nobody can see. No, it doesn't. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Making a mess. That came right open. All right. Here you go. Thanks. I love toffee. Yeah, Cheers. Me too. Mmm. Making a mess. Making a mess. So, I love Heath. Mm-hmm. Bars. <laughs> Before you say, who's he? Um, who's he? And score. Those are the two toffee bars we get, right? Mm-hmm. Mm, I really like the one. What's the candy? We have a candy bar that has little bits of toffee chopped up, but also nuts, so I can't eat any. Symphony makes it. Oh, yeah, Symphony. It's at like Hershey's. Hershey's Symphony. So those are our three choices, really. Unless you go to, like, a chocolate shop. Yeah, Heath is um, really good. That chocolate on that is so smooth. It's so different than what we have. I would yeah. feel like I feel like the Heath bars, the chocolate kind of kind of melts away, and then you're left with just a big thing of toffee, which I don't, you know, there's nothing wrong with that. No. That the the chocolate is so like rich and creamy. It's like on the verge of melting. You touch it and it's just mm -hmm. like, boom, put it in your mouth, it melts. But the little crunchy toffees, I like how it's different than like a Heath bar because it's chopped up and it's th right. throughout the bar instead of just That's like, what I was trying to say. So yeah. when you suck on a piece of like a Heath bar, the chocolate all melts away and you're left with Heath, which like I said, there's nothing wrong. I mean, you're left with toffee. There's nothing wrong with that, but I do like those little bits. Mm-hmm. That's, That's good. good. Very nice. Oh, what have we got here? An Oreo one? Yeah. Can you grab that plate there? I yes. feel like I've seen these here. Maybe, but I've never tried one. No. Oh, hey, look, it broke, right? How it should. Very nice. Oh, you're taking the small bit? Of course. All right. Cheers. Cheers. Hmm. Wow. It's, um, the inside of it is like little cookie bits, but the cream on the inside is like Oreo cookie cream that's in the middle. Which is the best and part. It's a, and it's a lot of it. But it's weird to me because that's milk chocolate, and I think of Oreo cookies as being like, Dark, not dark chocolate, like but... Like cocoa more. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? So it's Oreo cookie vibes, but different than just eating Oreo. You know, I it's not like Oreo cookies in a different uh, configuration. Right. Those are good. Mm-hmm. And these are the carrot milk. Oh, that's also by Cadbury. Hmm. I uh, haven't tried one of those, but we also have a caramel bar. So you want to try that and then this? Sure. Mm, make sure though. Is it all just um, caramel? I assume caramel, caramel. Look, that one also split. Nice. Yeah. Ooh. It's. We just had recently from a viewer friend in the UK sent. Well, a couple of them I think have sent us Cadbury eggs before. Yeah, the caramel ones. Mm-hmm. And that caramel is so dark and different than what we get. Mm-hmm. Uh, which looks like that. And I love mm -hmm. the runny caramel. 
Mm-hmm. That's good. I think I got some of that caramel on my mustache. I can't see it. <laughs> oh my gosh, where's the milk? I don't even John drinks so rich. John so drinks good. milk every single day of his life. That he, every time he gets a dessert, he wants milk. He wants milk. something sweet. Does your body good with milk? I only crave milk when I eat two things, usually. Well, three. Chocolate, cookies, and spaghetti. I always oh, yeah. want milk. I love having uh, milk with spaghetti. Mm-hmm. 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 That's mm-hmm. good. Mm-hmm. Uh, okay, caramel bar. Caramel do, bar. Do you need to look at it? I can't tell. Do I need to look at it? I don't the need picture. to look at it. No, checking for nuts. Oh, no, I don't it's think just so. like that. Okay. It's caramel. I have a nut allergy if you're new, so most of the time we can kind of tell, but... Ooh, ooh, ooh. There you go. Thanks. Cheers. So the same thing, but... Cheers. A bar, you said. Mm-hmm. Hmm. That's nice, too. Yeah, the bars get a good ratio. It's all about the ratio. John is completely (laughs) a ratio person. I'm a big texture person. I think you are, too, though. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. 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 Here's the thing. There are some things that um, the inside is, like, too much. Caramel doesn't bother me. There's no such thing as too much caramel to me. Right. So I liked it equally either way yeah me too can't go mm, wrong with that's chocolate good and caramel. smooth rich chocolate flake. Now, flake hello old friend this makes me want to cry <laughs> look at all the flake bars just like i mean i knew it was going to be a box full of flake bars but seeing them all lined up like that makes me so happy terry you're amazing it <laughs> That makes me you, so yeah, happy. You made a happy girl over there. In here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I thought you were going to say it over here. Uh-huh. All right. Careful. Easy. Don't don't breathe on it. it. Might explode everywhere. What is happening in this world? Uh, somebody forgot how to open stuff. Hey. Well, it starts to melt when you touch it, so yeah, I didn't yeah. want to touch your chocolate. There's. Mm. That's good. I did not know ever in my life that I was missing so many things until we started this YouTube channel. Right. Yeah. We started watching some people try stuff, and we're like, what, what is that? Where'd that go? You know, and we got, um, like, Snack Crate first. Mm-hmm. And UK was our first box. But it's amazing the different things that people make, you know, from their countries. And it's like, how can we get things so different? Mm-hmm. Mm. It's amazing. The what amazes to me is this... In, 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 invention. That... And it always surprises me that the same company mm-hmm. says Americans want to eat this and Canadians want to eat that or whatever. And, you yeah. know, the same company makes completely different, different things yeah. depending on the country. Yeah. That's... I don't know why we're off on that tangent all of a sudden. I don't know either. My point is we should be able to get all of this stuff anytime. I want it now, Daddy. <laughs> I want it now. Um, I want to get wow. the Wow. I mean, we've tried flake before. I cannot wait to try that on ice cream. That is all I am thinking about now. <coughs> that <coughs> and the one little lonely flake bar that has been in our freezer that talks to me every time I go to get ice or whatever can now... <laughs> uh, friends. Yeah. All right, Arrow Mint. I've waited for you my whole dang life. Don't let me down. So this is going to be that light chocolate that I like. I can smell it with mint. Mm, I'll try the smaller bit. Thank you. John doesn't love mint the way I do. He likes it. 
but he, yeah. he doesn't have the same relationship with mint as I do. No. Ready, go. That's a good mint. Oh my goodness. That reminds me of Andy's mint, but yes. airy and light and melty. Wow. I love that so much. My problem with Andy's mints are this. I love them. And I feel like I could make them rich by eating them on TV. <laughs> I mean, on YouTube. <laughs> because I can go on and on about how much I love them. Um, but they're just a little thing, right? Which is normally what I like. But in this flavor, I want a whole chocolate bar. Yeah. Because it's not like sickening sweet. No, it's it's very balanced. But it's very good. <laughs> this is exactly what I wanted this to be. Well, That's amazing. You can have it. There you go. That's amazing. Yeah, that's good. You know what we didn't do? We didn't rank anything yet. Yeah, I thought we'd... Well, we can do... Yeah, let's chew gum. I thought we could chew gum and talk about our rankings. All right, let's chew gum and talk about our rankings. Now, what's the deal with this? Are they different flavors? It says assorted chews. Hmm. Okay. And it's interesting, like, the colors. It's like mixed. There's hmm. blue. Blue and the red and red and the blue. Blue. I got the hiccups now. Right, hmm. They're like hard coated on the outside. Or maybe they're the kind of things you're supposed to suck on and they turn to gum. Mm. Yeah, they're crunchy gum. Mmm. Mm. That flavor is nice. That's got some sherbet in it. <laughs> My favorite. Woo! My friend sherbet. Got a little <laughs> sourness. Mm hmm. I love those. Wow, because it, it, and it's amazing because the flavor doesn't hit you at first. You gotta chew it up a little bit, and then pow! All of a sudden, it hits you. Right what in the mouth. What are they called? Mm. Ultimate Gourmet Select. Mm. Proudly Canadian. Look at the, yeah, look at the little maple leaf. Assorted chews bubble gum. Yummy. All right. All right. Do you want to rank? My favorite cookie out of the out of the box is this one. What about you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Those I, I love maple anything, maple cookies in particular, one of my favorite things. If you've never eaten a maple cookie, I beg you, if you love maple, go run and find a maple cookie. Um, they're amazing. Mm -hmm. Good job, whatever brand that was. Now, fruity stuff? Yep, fruity stuff. What do you think? Hmm. 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 Hmm, indeed. I'm going to say, have here chocolate. And you. Uh, so. I really, really like these. We can get them here. I'm going to find out too. Speaking of that. I want to know if we can get these here. Because I've definitely seen this brand. I've seen the. There's like a little thing. It looks like a syringe sort of. And kids could squeeze it. Like the gel into their mouth. That's a bad idea, right? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, a messy idea. Mm -hmm. um, but I haven't seen the gummies. Those were amazing. I like these, but we can get them here. But I so appreciate that that they say Rockets. We're starting a, a scrapbook, and I kind of want to keep the packaging for these. You know, um, when you send us letters and pictures and all of that stuff, we... Yeah, we're going to hold on to all that stuff. Yeah. Um, my favorite thing... To be honest with you, I think it was this popping candy. Yeah. I yeah. love popping candy so much. I don't know why. I'm like four years old. 
most of the time. Indefinitely. (laughs) Right? Like, I squeal, uh, you know, like a four-year-old when I see a cute kitten or whatever. A spider. (laughs) So do you. (laughs) That's true. Um, So (laughs) this kind of candy is right up my alley. And I loved, loved, loved the fact that this is apple, not sour apple. Which I like sour apple, but it's different than what we can get. So, number one. Uh, number two, I really liked, I mean, I oh, like these, I like these for me. I wouldn't like these as a parent, I don't think. No. It <laughs> but, looks like a mess in the waiting. Mm-hmm. Or in I the like making. Those. Or whatever. Then the Smarties. Is. And I really do like these. But I feel like I'd have to eat a whole mouthful of them. It's the kind of thing that you put a quarter in and get a whole bunch and mm-hmm. put all the candy in your mouth. Um, these are next for nostalgic reasons. And then these, that's my order. I like them all. That is my exact same order. Really? Yep. Mm, that never happens. I mean. Very rarely. Very rarely. Yeah. My, my order too. Okay. I have these chocolates. Oh, dang it. Do you want to go first or second? Um. Stuff is falling out. I'll go second. Um. Is this everything? Uh, uh, yes. This was number one. By leaps and bounds. This is number one. Way over here. I loved this bar. And now I'm sad that it's partially eaten. (laughs) I'm going to think about it. I've already been thinking about it, and I'm going to think about it and think about it some more. I loved that bar. Um, I really liked this dairy milk toffee thing. I think I actually, no. That's my order. Arrow, for sure. Then the toffee bar. Then the caramel bar. Uh, The bar and the egg are so similar. Um, For ease of eating, I say the bar and less messy fingers, and then the Oreo thing. I like the Oreo thing, too, just not as, I mean, it's not this Arrow Mint Bar, for sure, for me. Crazy enough, that's my exact same order as well. It is? Yeah. But you don't even like mint that much. Oh, I like mint. It's just not, like, usually my favorite thing. Like... It, I love mint. It's just usually not something that I choose. Isn't that strange? You like? Well, because I do like it a lot. If it's you're only not. picking a bar, one candy bar from the grocery store, you're you usually wouldn't pick mint. You would right. pick caramel or something like that. That's what makes me or something with nuts in it or something else. That's right. I'm like seriously, you would pick mint <laughs> over toffee and. I, I love the flavor with it, and the texture was so, like, airy and perfect, so that that's my order as well. Crap! <laughs> uh, no, you can have this. You can have I'm it. just kidding. So, oh, wait, 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 wait! Oh, don't forget about the flake! How could we forget about the flake? Uh, yeah, exactly. That's where we go. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Well, she doesn't know. I've talked about the flakes so much, and I do love it. I don't... It depends, right? It depends on if you're in the mood for mint or you're not. Yeah. That's so funny. Nothing. Oh, I do love that flake bar. Hmm. I am keeping that order for now. (laughs) Yeah. For now. For now. And speaking of which, now, no. Is that for you, too? That's yeah. where you put the flake? Okay. Yeah. yeah. I'm, cool. I'm the one that moved it over. Oh, I thought you were trying to guess my order. Oh, well, there you have it. Anyways, we don't agree on this kind of thing very often, and then we're always elated. I'm always sitting here thinking, I hope he hates the one I like. I hope he hates the one I like. <laughs> anyway, thank you, Terry, from <laughs> the bottom of our heart. This is so amazing, and we're so appreciative of all of this absolutely we have been looking into getting some stuff from canada here lately and and then your box came it was the perfect time yeah we're Um, excited and and, we and we have all this other stuff and we're gonna do separate videos on that so keep an eye out for that yeah 
Yeah, for sure. I'm so interested to try Marmite. And yeah. I'm, I mean, I know what I'm going to feel about the maple syrup. Um, I just don't know how I want to use it yet. I'll have to figure that out, what I want to do with it. Uh, anyway, so thank you, Weep. You never have to send us anything, but when you do, it means so very yeah. much. And, and your you letter. Do, it, we really appreciate it. So. And then, did you show the pin at yeah. the beginning? Yeah, you did at the beginning, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah. Stuff like that we love, too. If you're not uh, ever knowing what you can, you know, we've, ha we've had people ask in the comments, what can I send? And definitely, you can send us stuff. If you don't know what we've tried before, we don't know what we've tried before half the time. Yeah, half the time. We but forget. you know what I would love, and I think you would too, postcards for our book from where oh, you yeah. live or, you know, anything like that. We love your letters we and we love your comments. We read them all. So, so very much appreciate We've heard so many comments that... You know, our um, channel and some of our videos have helped you get through lockdown. And you know what? You guys have helped us get through lockdown. Your comments, um, you, you know, watching our show, us doing the videos. It kept us positive, too. Yeah. Every time we'd go on and we'd see positive comments, it, it made our day and made us want to make yeah. more videos. And... If we ever thought that we didn't have anything to do, we always had something to do, right? There's always okay. something new to try, and and we we love doing this together. People say, "Why did you start YouTube?" I don't know, but exactly. <laughs> I, I mean, there wasn't really, you know, you know what we should do. It wasn't like that. We just it just kind of evolved out of watching YouTube, and I'm so glad we can look back and we have all these videos to watch of us being silly and trying cookies or right. <laughs> whatever it is but uh it's fun for us so thank you so very much now yep. if you are not following us on social media come find us we're on facebook and tiktok and twitter kind of yeah we're on reddit although we don't even know what reddit is really uh the best places to find us are facebook and instagram I mean, there's a, there's several TikToks up. We just haven't done one in a while. Yeah. Or Pinterest, if you're interested in some recipes and what we're doing for our renovations. Some inspiration is on Pinterest. We are love and junk everywhere, just like we are here, except for on Instagram, love and junk, no D. We have two other channels. If you're interested, we have a game channel, which mostly is video games right now, but we're going to start playing board games as you can see we love to play board games we're going to be doing some more of that so if you're interested in that or um our other channel is satisfied and it's it's satisfying things we're going to be doing puzzles, puzzles. and sorting yeah, we did candy sorting i think there's like um a, a time lapse uh, like lawn mowing video i did it's things that are supposed to be visually appealing so if you're interested in either of those things or you just want to support us um you can subscribe and yeah you know those channels if you want to find them they're linked on our dashboard and and uh I don't know. We're working on those channels, too. Much more to come on those channels and this one in particular. Yeah. Uh, what else do I have to say? Now, if you like Canada. Yeah, if you like Canada. Or... Terry. Yeah. <laughs> or Old Dutch. Yeah. Or Maple. Yeah, Maple. Or yeah. Flake Bars. Yeah. Or Laura. Yeah, or John. Uh, or this video. Then give this video a big thumbs up. Yeah. That's all we have for today. See you tomorrow with another video. Thanks again, Terry, so very much. That's it, guys. That's it. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.